Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Crack and Pack with Josh. Where on tonight's late night episode, we're gonna be opening up some call time. Uh, the latest set for Magic. Um, got a couple of regular boosters. Got a couple of the set boosters because I'm really excited for the art on these cards. And we also got some theme boosters. I got Viking, Viking, and Green. Um, but before we get into it, just wanted to say um, thank you guys for all of your support. Um, it means a lot. Um, and if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, please do so. Um, it means a lot. Um, and yeah, help me get along with the YouTube algorithm. Um, if... <laughs> If if anybody know if anybody's in touch with the YouTube algorithm and they want to give me a hand getting in touch with the YouTube algorithm, please help me out. <laughs> um, hey Arturo, how you doing, brother? <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna be looking at these. Um, Kaldheim is all about Norse mythology and uh, Vikings and whatnot. And here we got a little got a little camera tilt. All right, there we go. Um, we got some high price cards. We got Frexian Vorinclex Monstrous Raider at 39 bucks. Um, we got regular cards like 25, 23, 12. And then we also got the, the variants. Um, this one's the Phyrexian Vorinclex. Um, for some reason it's written in Phyrexian and you can't fucking read it. <laughs> But that's sixty dollars. Um, there's the alt art Warren Collect for forty eight. Uh, there's two different Valkies, and a bunch of other stuff. So yeah, I've been really looking forward to this set because the art looks amazing. And that's why on today's episode we're gonna be opening uh not only draft boosters but set boosters and uh theme boosters. Um. Okay, so yeah, let's get into this. Um, I think we'll start with the with the Viking ones, then do the green. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, really looking forward to this set. Not just because of the art, but also because of the theme. Um, I think this is like a completely new uh, plane for Magic. Uh, I don't think they've ever been to Call Time before. And um, they brought back a couple of uh, elements like uh, like Snowlands from previous sets. And uh, yeah, it looks really interesting. Here, let's just open up all these real quick so we can go through this quick. <laughs> um, but yeah, I wanted to start off with these uh, with these rainbow theme decks just so we can get like a sense of the cards before we. Um, Jump into the booster packs. Yeah, okay. So yeah, that one's gonna be the green. Let's start off with one of the Viking ones. So yeah, how's everybody's day going? Um, had a bit of a late start to my day just because I slept in. Hella, nothing new. Um, actually, wait, hold on. Let me grab my sleeves. <laughs> Because, again, why would I be prepared for an episode, right? Like, <laughs> um, but yeah, a bit of a late start to the, my day, um, but we ended up going out, getting stuff done. It was nice. Uh, Warhorn Blast, okay. You just control 2-1, tell him to turn, foretell. Okay, so I think this is a new ability. During your turn, pay 2 and exile this card from your hand face down, cast it on a later turn for its foretell cost. Okay, neat. All right, yeah. Sounds cool. Um, I wonder what that symbol is in the back. Um, I'm sure we'll find out. Uh, Raiders Carve. It's a boat. When it attacks, look at the top card of your library. If it's land, you can put it onto the battlefield tapped. Crew three. Yeah. Okay. It's not bad. That's not bad. <clears throat> um, never was really a fan of the vehicle cards. Um, but yeah, Rune of Light. Uh, Aura Rune. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay, enchant permanent. When it enters the battlefield, draw a card. <clears throat> as long as enchanted permanent is a creature, it has flying. As long as enchanted permanent is an equipment, it has 
Equipped creature has flying. That's sick. Okay. Huh. Auras. Sure. That seems cool. Nice. We'll keep an eye out for those. Uh, code spell cleric. 1-1 one, one vigilance. One edge of the battlefield. If it was the second spell you cast this turn, put a 1-1 one, one on target creature. Sick. Okay. For one drop, that's pretty nice. Uh, stalwart Va Valkyrie. You can pay one and exile a creature card from your graveyard rather than pay this spell's mana cost. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sick. That's cool. And again, like, look at this art. Like, that's beautiful. Youthful Valkyrie, Angel, another Angel onto the battlefield, and control, put a 1 1 on Youthful Valkyrie. Nice. Dude, that's sick. Before she is admitted to the host of Starnheim, young Valkyrie must learn a thousand tales of her ancestors. Cool, okay. So, are all angels in this set Valkyries? Seems cool. Um, Valor the Worthy, Enchanted Creature, gets 1 1. When Enchanted Creature leaves the battlefield, create a 1 1 White Spirit creature token with flying. If I'm to die, let it be a hero's death. Again, look at that art. That's sick. Um, yeah, see, so they also brought back, um, snow creatures. Uh, just like they brought up, uh, snow lands and whatnot. Okay, so, Berg Strider, Giant Wizard, when you spell field, tap target artifact, or creature in opponent controls. If a snow land was spent to cast the spell, that permanent doesn't untap during its controller's next untap step. Sick. Okay. And all the giants are wizards? Dude, that's cool. Okay. Avalanche Caller. Uh, one three pay two target snowland control becomes a four four elemental with hexproof and haste. Damn, that's sick. Very useful. Uh, raven form exile target for artifact creature control gets one one bird with foretell. Sick. Okay. Uh, run amok target creature tagging creature gets three three and gains trample. Ooh, sick. Red trample. That's good. Nice. Okay. A uh, bearded axe, sure, gets 1-1 one, one for each dwarf equipment and or vehicle you control. Oh, dude. So, like, a dwarf equipment deck? Okay. Dwarven Arson spends the first hundred years of their life forging a single weapon and infusing it with runic magic. Okay, cool. That's pretty fucking sick. Okay. Uh, Battleshield Warrior, 2-2 two, two, Boast. Creatures control, get 1-1 one, one, till in turn. What is boast? Ta activate this ability only if the creature attack this turn and only once each turn. Oh, okay. Sure. Uh, we got Valor of the Worthy again. Uh, we got Jarl of the Forsaken. Ooh, okay. Zombies. Zombie Cleric. Okay. When you're all the Forsaken and the battlefield destroy target creature or planeswalker, that was dealt damage this turn. With Fortel. Sure. Okay. Uh, Draugr Selm. When it's battlefield, you can pay two and a swamp. If you do, create two two zombie berserker token. Then attach the helmet to it. Gets two two and has menace. Cool. Okay. Powerful keener master. And it's battlefield. The two target creature each gets one zero, and gains indestructible and ten turn. Okay, that's cool. But again, look at that art. Hell yeah, dude. Fucking zombie berserkers. That's sick. So yeah, one reason why I wanted to start off with the theme deck so we can get a good look at these cards before later on going in through the uh, through the other packs and kind of just like rushing through it. Um, so 7-6 Trample, when it dies it deals 7 damage to a creature and opponent controls chosen at random. Damn! That's fucking sick. <laughs> uh, Frenzy Drader, activate a boast ability, put a 1-1 one -one on it. Okay. Sure. Axe Guard Cavalry. Aw, oh, dude. It's a dwarf and she's riding a little goat. Oh, hell yeah. Target creature gains haste until end of turn. Nice. Okay. I wonder if dwarves are just the goblins of this set, you know? Um, exile top card of your library. You can play that card this turn. Oh. Okay. That's cool. A uh, Death Kneel Berserker. Uh... Death Nail Berserker dies of its powers. Three greater create two two black zombie berserker. Oh, okay. Neat. Whoa, is this a Dark Angel? What? Okay. Vengeful Reaper, Flying Death Touch Haste, and Foretell. Dude, that's fucking sick. 
Dark Angels. Okay. Nice. Okay. So that's probably um that's probably Orzov, huh? That symbol. Starnheim is close to you, coward. Okay. Sure. Okay. Uh, Grim Draugr, Zombie Berserker, gets 1-0 and gains Menace until end of turn. Okay, sure. Got Raven Form again. Oh, what's this? Oh, they got they brought back Sagas. Okay. Neat. Okay. So, if you don't know about Sagas, each turn you get a lore counter and then each one of these abilities activates. And then once the last one's activated, it goes forever. Um, okay, so you sacrifice a creature when you do... It deals 3 damage to any target. Second, each player discards a card and return target creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. Put a 1-1 one, one on it and gains haste until your next end, uh, till your next turn. Sweet! Okay. Nice. Uh, Dread Rider, exile target creature from your graveyard. Get lose Each target opponent loses 3 life. Oh! Okay. But still, again, look at that fucking art. Fuck, yeah, man. Okay. Um, Raise the Draugr. Turn target creature card from graveyard to your hand. Turn tar two target creature cards that share creature type from your graveyard to your hand. Okay, cool. Um, snow creature angel wizard. Hailstorm Valkyrie. Weird. So, a black creature has trample? That's, that's fucking weird. Okay. So, flying trample and two snow lands gets 2-2 two, two until end of turn. Dude, that's fucking good. Okay. Oh, uh, we got Bergstrider. Invasion of the Giants. Okay. Scry 2, draw a card, then you can reveal a giant card from your hand. When you do, deals 2 damage to target opponent or Planeswalker. The next giant spell you cast this turn costs 2 less to cast. Damn. So is it like, is that giants? Are they like the spell slingers of this realm? That sounds cool. Uh, Cinderheart Giant, seen him. Uh, Draugr Recruiter. Boast three return to a creature card from graveyard to your hand. Sick. Okay. All right. And what we got on the end? We got rune of mortality. And the battlefield draw card. As long as a chant permanent is a creature, it has death touch. And as long as a chant permanent is an equipment, it has equipped creature has death touch. Okay. Sure. Ooh. Okay. Here we go. Nice. Uh, we got surfed land flinger. Giant Berserker, when he when he attacks, you can sacrifice another creature. When you do, deals damage equal to that sacrificed creature's power to any target. If the sacrificed creature was a giant, deals twice that much damage instead. Damn! So, it's a creature with fling built into it. And if you're running a giant deck, it fucking does it twice. Dude, that's fucking crazy. Okay. Damn. That's sick. Okay. Alright, I'm sorry I know I went through that kind of slow, just because I wanted to get a feel for the cards before we get into the booster packs, so this episode isn't like two hours long. <laughs> so yeah, I promise this one will go by quicker. Okay, so what we got here? Renegade Reaper, Angel Berserker, and it's Battlefield Mill 4 cards. If at least one angel is milled this way, you gain four life. Ooh, okay, sure. Uh, Dread Rider, seen it. Uh, Dusk Wielder, Elf Berserker, Bose, Target Punt loses life and you gain a life. Okay, sure. Uh, seen it, seen it. Fire Giant's Fury. Target Giant in control gets 2-2 two -two and gains Trample. Whenever it deals combat damage to a player, exile that many cards from the top of your library. Until the end of your next turn, you can pay, play those cards. Oh, shit. Okay. Damn. Imstrom Raider. Yeah, it's a battlefield. You can discard a card if you do draw a card. Cool. Okay. Thorn Mantle Striker. And it's a battlefield. Choose one. Remove X counters from target permanent where X is the number of elves you control. Oh, shit. Okay. So, like, Elf Tribal. Opponent controls gets XX until it turns where X is the number of elves you control. Sick. Okay. Oh, man. I might do elves this deck. Okay. Bound in Gold. Enchant Permanent. Champ permanent can't attack, block, or crew vehicles, and its activated abilities can't be activated. Damn, that sucks. Trespassers will be smelted. <laughs> Damn, that's cool. Okay. Okay. A uh, Doomcar Titan. Doomscar Titan. Enter battlefield. Target creatures in control gets 1-0 and gains haste with Fortel. Sure. Uh, Iron Verdict. 
Deals five damage to target tapped creature with foretell. Damn, dude. Damn. I mean, you're gonna need that against all of these uh these uh, giants. Uh, create a one one white human warrior creature token. Okay. And again, look at that art. That's beautiful. Friggin' spirit warrior. Hell yeah, man. Uh, Warhorn blast. Horizon seeker. Boast. Search your library for a basic land. Reveal it. Put it into your hand. Okay. A uh, blizzard brawl. Snow sorcery. Interesting. Okay. Target creature you control and target creature you don't control. If you control three or more, snow permanence. That creature you control gains one zero and gains indestructible intent and a turn. And then they fight. Damn, that's sick. Okay. Uh, we got Mask Vandal, uh, Changeling. When he enters the battlefield, you may exile a creature card from a graveyard. If you do, exile target artifact or permanent or enchantment in opponent controls. Damn. Okay. So there's Changelings in here too. Okay. Um. Oh, seen it. Uh, Blood Sky Berserker. Damn, look at that art. Hell yeah. Um, cast a second spell each turn. Put two 1-1 one, one counters on Blood Sky Berserker. Gains Menace. Damn. That can get out of hand quick. Okay. Uh, Dusk Wielder, seen it. Doomscar Oracle. When you cast a second spell each turn, you gain two life. With Fortel. Damn. Okay. Man, I think Fortel is going to be like a huge ability in this. Um, okay. Angel Warrior, uh, Stalwart Valkyrie. Graveyard, rather than pay this... Oh yeah, we've seen this one. Yeah. But again, look at that art. Beautiful. Like, damn, what the hell is going on here? Rampage of the Valkyries. When it enters the battlefield, to create a 4-4 white angel token with flying and vigilance. Whenever an angel you control dies, each other player sacrifices a creature. Ooh. Damn, that's serious. Okay. Uh, Grim Draugr, seen it. Uh, Image from Raider, seen it. Cardur the Doom Scourge. Okay. Demon Berserker, when in Spotfield, until your next turn. Creatures your opponent control attack each combat, if able, and attack a player other than you, if able. <laughs> when attack the creature dies, each opponent loses life and you gain life. But dude, look at how fucking sick that art is. Hell yeah, dude. That's sick. Okay. Uh, Tusket Fireweaver, seen it. Run Amok, seen it. Tormentor's Helm, gets 1-1 one, one when a cryptic creature becomes blocked. Deals 1 damage to defending player. Okay, decent for a 1-drop. Cole, the Forge Master. Okay, when another non-token creature control dies, if it was enchanted or equipped, turn it to its owner's hand. What? Wow. Creature tokens you control that are enchanted or equipped get 1-1. One, one. Dude, that's fucking sick. And again, look at that art. Like, look how shiny that sword is. Dude, that's sick. I'm so excited for this set. Okay, uh, Doomscar Oracle, seen it. Uh, Raider's Carve, seen it. Uh, Berkstrider, seen it. Uh, Agar, the Freezing Flame. Okay. Giant Wizard, when a creature, Planeswalker, and opponent controls is dealt excess damage. Oh, okay. If a giant wizard or spell you control deal damage to it this turn, draw a card. Huh, okay. Excess damage. Okay, so like, maybe like if they have trample or something, or like, you kind of just smack them with a bunch of fireballs or something. Interesting. Okay. And then on the end, we got Skemfar Avenger. Okay. When another non-token elf or berserker you control dies. Draw a card and you lose life. Okay. Interesting. Hold on, let me see if we can get a better look at that card. Yeah, right there. Interesting. Okay. Dude. Maybe they're trying to bring back Elf Tribal or something? Because I know Elves are a huge thing in, uh, like, Norse mythology. Um, I don't know if they were exactly called Elves, but they were, like, Elven creatures. Um, but yeah. Alright, nothing too crazy out of those. Let's blast through this green one, and then let's get into the packs. Um, if I could open this... Okay, yeah. <laughs> but, you know, okay. So yeah, let's let's bust through this real quick. Um, see, we changeling... 
Path of the World Tree. Oh, wait, we haven't seen this. In this battlefield, search your library for a basic land card, reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. Two and all the colors, sacrifice Path of the World Tree, you gain two life and draw two cards. Target opponent loses two life. Path to the World Tree deals two damage to up to one target creature. And you get a 2-2 bear? Wow, okay. <laughs> That's a lot of stuff. Okay. Grizzled Outrider, 5-5 five, five Elf Warrior. It's fucking riding a bear. Cool. <laughs> uh, Elven Ambush, sick. Created 1-1 one, one Green Elf Warrior creature token for each elf you control. Damn! Okay. Uh, Jaspera Sentinel, 1-2 uh, Reach, tap and untap creature you control. Add one mana of any color. Dude, that's fucking sick. Okay. Uh, broken Wings. Uh, destroy target artifact, enchantment, or creature with flying. Damn. Okay. Sculptor of Winter. Untap target Snowland. Ooh, that could get dangerous. Okay. Uh, Ice Hydral. Dude, check that fucking art. Dude, that's nuts. Okay. Gets 2 0 and gains indestructible to end a turn. Tap it. Weird. Okay, so maybe you just use it as like a defense. Interesting. Okay, Gladewalker Ritualist. Changeling, when another creature named Gladewalker Ritualist enters the battlefield under control, draw a card. Okay, sure. And another one? Okay. Despair Sentinel. Okay, Rune of Might. When in the battlefield, draw a card. Giant Permanent is a creature, gets 1 1, has trample. And then if it's equipment, equipped a creature, gets 1 1, has trample. Okay, nice. Okay, so I think we've seen, um, I think the only ones we're missing are like the blue one and the red one, right? But I'm sure we'll see those. Uh, Horizon Seeker. Uh, oh wait, we've seen that. Uh, Mammoth Growth. Target creature gets 4-4 four, four in tone, turn, and foretell. Hell yeah, man. Okay. Struggle from Strem... Skemfar? Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get used to these names. Uh, put a 1-1 one, one counter on target creature you control, then that creature fights up to one target creature you don't control. With Fortel. Okay, nice. Uh, Sentinel, seen it. Col Colossal Plow. Okay. 2-2 two, two vehicle, or 6-3 two-drop vehicle. Whenever it attacks, add 3 planes, and you gain 3 life. Until end of turn, you don't lose this mana as steps and phases end. Damn. Oh, I see. Ta crew 6. I get it. All right. Uh, Elven Bow. When it's battlefield, could pay two if you do create an elf warrior token, then attach it to it. Gets one, two, and reach. Nice. Okay. Sculptor Winter. Sarful's Packmate. When it's battlefield, draw card. Foretell two. Okay. Sure. Struggle. Seen it. Runamite. Seen it. Horizon Seeker. Seen it. Mammoth Growth. Seen it. Oh. Glittering Frost. Dude, I love that fucking art. Dude. Fucking, hold on, who is that? Lucas Graciano, thank you. That's fucking sick. Enchant land, enchant land, snow. Whenever enchant land is tapped for mana, its controller adds an additional mana of any color. Dude, that's some great fucking ramp. Okay. Damn, okay. Uh, Finn the Fangbearer, Death Touch. Oh, that, that was the dude who was on the cover of the... Uh, what is it? Yeah, the Viking thing. Yeah, that's him. Sick. Okay. Uh, one three death touch. When a creature control with death touch deals combat damage to a player, that player gets two poison counters. Okay. That's weird. I haven't seen any other poison counters yet. Interesting. Okay. Gets two two has reach and is every creature type. Arachnoform. Dude, look at that art. That's fucking sick. Yo. <laughs> okay. Uh, Masked Vandal. Okay. Elven Bow. Okay. Guardian Gladewalker. Changeling. When ends the battlefield, put a 1 1 on target creature. Cool. Uh, Lit Litjara Glade Warden. Another Changeling. Exile creature card from the graveyard. Put two 1 1s on target creature. Activate this ability only anytime you can cast a sorcery. Damn. Okay. But again, like, look at how, like,. Look how metal this this fucking art is. Like, you see the dude, and then you also see, like, the spirits behind him. Like, look at that. That's beautiful. Sick. Okay. Uh, Raven Wings gets 1-0, has flying, and is a bird in addition to its other types. Cool. <laughs> um, 
the Dog Boy uh, Roots of Wisdom, Mill 3, then Return to Land, or Elf from your graveyard to your hand if you can't draw a card. Okay. So I wonder if the Elf deck is also a Mill deck. Interesting. Okay. And on the end... <gasps> Whoa! Oh, shit. Okay. Yo! I... I... Okay. Tell me... Tell me why I thought you couldn't get a Mythic in one of the themed decks. Dude, we got a fucking Vorinclex. Dude, that is a fucking $40 card. <laughs> dude, that's fucking sick. Hell yeah, dude. All right, let's read this bad boy. So Vorinclex, Monstrous Raider. 6-6, uh, six, six, six drop, trample haste. If you put one or more counters on a permanent or player... Put twice that many of each of those kinds of counters on that permanent or player instead. And an opponent would put one or more counters on a permanent or a player that they put half that many of each of those kinds of counters on that permanent or player instead, rounded down. Dude, that's a fucking dick move. <laughs> but dude, I'm so stoked that we got one of these. Hell yeah. And we haven't even like... Oh my... Oh my lord. Hold up. Let me, let me show you guys what we're talking about here, because we haven't even gotten to, like, the bulk of this episode. <laughs> we got, like, hold on, let me count these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We got nine draft packs, and we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We got eleven set boosters. So we got, like, twenty more packs to go. We're gonna, oh, man, but I'm so excited that we got this so early. Hell yeah, man. Let's see if we can get another one. <laughs> Dude, that's awesome. Uh, I'm so excited. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's see what's up here. Uh, Depart the Realm. Ooh, okay. Target non-land permanent to its owner's hand with Fortel. Sure. Um, we got that Amistrum Raider. Seen it. Valor the Worthy. Seen it. Um, Dread Knight. Seen it, but again, like, love that fucking art. Look at that. Oh, hi, Kelsey. I love you too. <laughs> oh, sweetheart. Okay. Um, ooh, Ice High Troll? Hell yeah. Um, Code Spell Cleric. Have you seen this one? And answer the battlefield. If it was the second spell you cast this turn, put a 1 1 on target creature. I think we've seen it. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Um, Bound in Gold. Seen it. Shackles, wait, Shackles of Treachery? Okay. You can control target creature, untap that creature until end of turn gains haste, and when this creature deals damage, destroy target equipment attached to it. Oh, man. Okay. Sure. <laughs> oh, hi, sweetheart. Um, okay. When Elder Leaf Mentor enters the battlefield, create an elf. Okay. Sure. Whoa, what is this? Fall of the Imposter. Dude, look at that fucking art. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know anything about this, but I want to watch. <laughs> yeah, well, thank you so much for being here. It means a lot. <laughs> Put a 1-1 one, one on up to one target creature. Exile a creature with the greatest power amongst creatures. Target opponent controls. Okay, yeah. But yeah, I wouldn't expect you to be into this nerd stuff. <laughs> Uh, Spirit of Aldergard. Bear Spirit. Oh, look at him. Okay. When he enters the battlefield, search the library for a snow land. Reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. Gets 1-0 for each other snow permanent you control. Damn. Okay. That can get out of hand. Oh. Ooh. Look at that. Okay. Herald King of Skemfar. Neat. Okay. Uh, three two menace. Oh wait, this isn't even the legendary. Damn. Okay. Um, when he enters the battlefield, look at the top five cards of your library. You can feel an elf, warrior, or Tyvar. <laughs> From among them, and put it into your hand. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in random order. Okay. It's not nerd stuff. Just nerd stuffs I don't know about currently. Yeah, true. <laughs> and then, ooh. Okay. Um. Tyrite Sanctum. I just like the pretty pictures and the sound it makes when you open a pack. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's one thing I love about the cards, too. Like, 
like just the art on these like look at that look at that bad boy okay uh tap add a colorless create target legendary creature becomes a god in addition to other types put a one one on it and then four tap sacrifice it put an indestructible counter on target god oh wait so that's not until end of turn oh dude so you could just make gods that's fucking sick okay and then, like, yeah, like, even something simple as these little, like, snow-covered lands. Like, look at the art on that. That's beautiful. Hell yeah. And, ooh, shiny. Elder Leaf Mentor. Fuck yeah, man. That's nice. Sick. Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay, that's going in the sleeve pile. Oh, man. <laughs> crinkle, crunkle, crinkle. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, man. Nice. But yeah, thank you guys. I, I really appreciate you guys being here. Uh, Breakneck Berserker, 3-2 Haste. Damn. Look at that stout motherfucker. <laughs> uh, Warhorn Blast, seen it. Mr. Lemuria, seen it. Haggy Mob? What the hell's a Haggy? Uh, Troll Berserker, boast. Haggy Mob deals one damage to any target. Oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> Horizon Seeker, beautiful. Coma's Faithful. Oh, look at him. 3 1 lifelink. When it dies, each player mills three cards. Oh, but look at that. Getting along with nature. Uh, Sculptor of Winter, hell yeah. Shackle Treachery. <laughs> Haggy Mob is my true form. <laughs> yeah, a bunch of trolls, Kelsey. Yeah. <laughs> Just a large conglomerate of trolls. <laughs> I like this one over here on the end. <laughs> With the rock. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Here, let's see what else we get. Okay, so Elder Leaf. We got Bound and Gold. We got Replicating Ring. Excuse me? Okay. Add one mana of any color at the beginning of upkeep. Put a knight counter on it. Then, it ha then if it has eight or more knight counters on it, remove all of them and create eight colorless snow artifact tokens named replicate and ring with add one mana of any color oh <laughs> okay <laughs> uh okay blood sky berserker hell yeah man you've seen it <laughs> uh that's funny seeing you throwing rocks okay um mori of the frost is it mori is it morite oh man okay Hold on, before I read that, I want to look at that art. Like, look at that fucking shit. That's crazy. Damn, okay. You can have um, you can have it enter the battlefield as a copy of a permanent you control, except it's legendary, and snow in addition to its other types, and if it's a creature, enters with two additional 1-1s one on it, and has changeling. Damn, that's nuts. And that's not even legendary. Or, not mythic. Um, oh! Ooh, Goldspan Dragon. Okay, dude, look how large that fucking dragon is. Damn. 4-4 four, four Flying Haste, when it attacks or becomes the target of a spell, create a treasure. Treasure tokens have tap, sack this, add two mana of any color. Damn, okay. Dude, that's a $23 card. I'm sleeping that bad boy right now. And then Snow Plains and Zombie Berserker. What's the 1-1 one, one mean? Oh, okay, so yeah. Um, you see these guys down here? Uh, the one on the left is attack, and the one on the left is defense. Um, so 1-1 one, one just means you give them an extra... Uh, you add one to those. So if I put one onto here, suddenly this dragon has 5 attack and 5 defense. But yeah, look at that bad boy. That is a pretty dragon. Hold on, let me sleeve that and then... Look at that bad boy. Damn. Chilling on this, like, bridge made of gold. That's sick. Okay. Hell yeah. But yeah, I'm really glad that you guys really like this. Um, I, I really appreciate you guys for watching this. It means a lot.
<laughs> oh my god, Teacher Josh. <laughs> oh, thank you, sweetheart. Um, Axe Guard Bargain. Ian. It's a fucking dwarf with a huge rock. <laughs> okay. Um, Joshua Senpai. <laughs> thank you, thank you. It means a lot. Um, Depart the Realm. Look at that fucking art. That is sick. Um, return target non land permanent to its owner's hand with Fortel. Okay. <laughs> uh, Immunstrom Raider, seen it. Valkyrie the Worthy, seen it. Broken Wings, seen it. But yeah, I gotta say, like, I love this fucking art. And, like, the Norse mythology. Like, this is crazy. Gets 1 1. When it deals combat damage to the player, create a treasure token. It's an artifact with tap, sacrifice this, add one mana of any color. Cool. Looks like Aurora Borealis. Yeah, yeah, it does. I think that's what they were going for, make, making it look all, like, spiritual and whooshy. Like, look at that. That's beautiful. Yeah, see, I was really excited for this set. That's why I bought so many goddamn cards. <laughs> uh, Augury Raven, uh, Flying and Fortel. Okay, look at this pretty bird. A uh, pretty bird. <laughs> Um, Arachnoform, we've got Avalanche Caller, got Fearless Liberator, okay, Dwarf, created 2-1 Red Dwarf, Berserker, okay, neat, Gates of Istfel, oh my lord, look at that, again, more Borealis, yeah, in person the Borealis is so beautiful, yeah, I've always wanted to go see it, um, never got a chance to, but I've always wanted to, um, <laughs> pretty bird. Yeah, pretty bird. Um, Enter the battlefield tapped at, uh, out of planes. Uh, wait, five and tap? Sacrifice it, sacrifice it, you gain two life and draw two cards. Okay, sick. Um, Draugr Necromancer. Oh, this is the rare. Nice. non token creature and opponent controls would die. Exile that card with an ice counter on it instead. <laughs> Bro, Josh, let's go to Iceland. I'd be down. Hell yeah! <laughs> Draugr Necromancer. Look at that fucking art, man. <laughs> My bad, I'm off topic. No, you're fine. That's why I like doing these lives. I like chatting with people. Um, cast spells from monk cards and exile an opponent. Your opponent's own with ice counters on them. You may spend mana from snow sources as though it were mana of any color to cast those spells. Damn. Okay. So, like, you could exile shit and then just, like, play it again? Damn. That's crazy. Okay. Brody looks like a White Walker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think it's kind of hard to uh, not have it look like an, a White Walker when it's all just a bunch of snow zombies. <laughs> uh, Snow-covered mountain. Look at that fucking art, though. Got that discarded shield right there. Um, oh! Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. look how pretty that is. Hell yeah. That's what's up. Ooh, that's going in the sleeve pile for sure. Okay. <laughs> oh, man, okay. But yeah, like I said, <clears throat> thank you guys for your support. It means a lot that anybody fucking watches this at all. And, again, like I always say, I, I look forward to this every week. Oh, look at this fearless pup. Little wolf howling to the moon. Uh, one one first strike. Oh, look at the little puppy. Oh. <laughs> um, we got story seeker. Uh, dwarf cleric two two life link. Okay. Dude, damn. <laughs> oh, I love you too, sweetheart. That means a lot. Zombie cleric, dude. Look at this fucking art. This is fucking crazy. Okay. Snow creature, zombie cleric. Uh, sacrifice it. Target creature gets minus X, minus X, where X is the number of snow lands you control. Only anytime you can cast a sorcery. Okay. Sick. Okay. Got Vault Robber. We got Iron Verdict. We got the Pick. We got the Pretty Bird. Uh, Caw. <laughs> uh, Shepherd of the Cosmos. What the fuck? Dude, look at that. It's got, like, ephemeral wings. Like, what is that? 
Damn. Okay, 3-3. Three, three. When it enters the battlefield, turn target permanent card with converted mana cost 2 or less from a graveyard to the battlefield. So is X like a number you choose? Yeah, actually, yeah, good good thing you pointed that out. Yeah, so where X, um, a lot of the abilities will determine what X is. So this X is determined by the number of snow lands you control, which are uh, these ones. So normally they just be like basic lands, but these ones are special snow covered lands. And so the more you have of this on the field, the more this ability goes up. So yeah. <laughs> uh, see, this is also nice. I never thought that I'd be like teaching people about magic. <laughs> um, but yeah, very astute of you. Good eye. <laughs> uh, enter battlefield tapped, add a mountain, pay six, sacrifice it, destroy target land, create a 4-4 four -four green troll with trample. Neat. Okay. Tegrid Shadow? Okay. Each player sacrifices two creatures and foretell. Oh, that's a dick move. Okay. <laughs> I'm dumb as fuck. Don't, don't you beat yourself up like that. That You stop that. You stop that. <laughs> um, but we got Arnie Broken Bro. Or Brow, sorry. <clears throat> Um, Human Berserker 3-3 three, three with Boast can change his base power to 1 plus the greatest power amongst other creatures you control until end of turn. Okay. Damn, that's sick. Okay. Uh, Snow Covered Mountain, cool. And ooh, shiny. Alright. Skemfar Shadow Mage. Man, look at that fucking art. Hold on, let me... Is that better? Yeah, look at that. Look at the fucking detail on that. Look how shiny that bowl is. <laughs> um, have we seen this one? Enter the battlefield, choose one. Each opponent loses two life. Legendary creature, that's what they called me in high school. <laughs> yep, because you're a legend. You're legendary. <laughs> uh, each opponent loses X, where X is the greatest number of creatures you control that have a creature type in common. You gain X, where X is the greatest... Number of creatures you control that have a creature type in common. Okay, sure. And then we got a human warrior. Nice. Oh boy. Man. I might need to take like a little water break before we go on to the rest of the packs. Like, fuck me. I didn't realize how long this episode was going to be. Um, but thank you guys for sticking it out with me. <laughs> means a lot, and I appreciate you a ton. Season spoils, gold maw. And also, I did say it at the top of the episode. Wait, Snake? Oh, okay. Ravenous Lindworm. When it enters the battlefield, you gain four life. Cool. Okay, nice. Um, but yeah, like I said at the top of the episode, um, help a brother out. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you if you haven't already. Uh, it means a lot. <laughs> um, giant Amulet. <laughs> um, artifact Equipment. When it enters the battlefield, you can pay three. If you do, create a 4-4 blue giant wizard. Then attach it to it. It gets 0-1 has... This creature has hexproof. As long as it's untapped. Oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> Aw, thank you, sweetheart. Yeah. <laughs> um, the link should be in the description of this video. Um, if it doesn't work, I'm sorry. But I'll post a video to it uh, later. So yeah, you can check it out. Uh... Lajara Mirror Lake and just tapped, uh, tap it at a, uh, uh, an island, sacrifice it, create a token that's a copy of target creature you control, except it enters the battlefield with a 1-1 one, one on it, activate this ability only in time you can cast a sorcery. Sick! Okay. Oh! We got the squirrel! <laughs> we got Toski, Bear of Secrets, spell can't be countered, 1-1 uh, one, one indestructible, Attacks each combat if able. When a creature you control deals combat damage to a player, draw a card. Okay, nice. So yeah, this is based off of um, uh, Ratatasker, the um, the squirrel god who climbs up and down the, the world tree. Um, it's pretty interesting. Yeah, okay. Uh, Alpine Meadow. Oh, it's a mountain plains. Neat. It has battlefield tapped. 
I did it. I'm subscribed. <laughs> Thank you, sweetheart. I appreciate you immensely. <laughs> I think that makes you sub 23? Or something like that? Yeah. I'm, all, I'm subscribed to your YouTube. Thank you, Arturo. It means a lot, brother. Thank you so much. Yeah, and I hope you're doing alright, man. I haven't seen you in ages. Uh, zombie wizard at an island. Spend this only to foretell a card from your hand. Or cast an instance or sorcery spell. Okay, cool. Yeah, again, look at this, like, golden, like, zombie-looking thing. With, like, ice hands. Uh, we got the the dwarf cavalry. Hell yeah. Uh, God's Hall Guardian. Oh, look at this pretty kitty. Oh, big old kitty. 3-6 Vigilance with Fortel. Damn. Look at that. <laughs> Imagine trying to play with his paws like that. Just like poking him from under. <laughs> uh, Horizon Seeker, Draga Recruiter, Frostbeak Yeti. Uh, it's just a fucking Yeti. <laughs> that thing's fucking huge. Okay. Pay one and a Snow Plains, or a Snowland. Frostbeak can't be blocked this turn. Okay, damn. That's it. Okay. Invoke the Divine. Ooh, that's pretty. Oh man, that's sick. That's beautiful. All right, store target artifact or enchantment. You gain four life. Nice. Uh, self Rook's pack mage. Seen it. Jarl of the Forsaken. Oh yeah, we seen it. Uh, open omen pass. Oh look, it's Tibble. It's fucking demon dude. <laughs> um, choose one. Add two mana of any color, and two mana of any other color. What? Is that a phoenix? Wait, which one's a phoenix? Oh, the invoke? It kind of looks like it's phoenix, but it also looks like um an angel. Kind of. Yeah, but either way, that's beautiful, right? Look at that. That's so pretty. Yeah, I think it might be an angel. Um. Okay, so yeah, demon dude. Add two mana of any one color and two mana of any other color. Spend this mana only to cast creature enchantment spells. How much is this spell? So it's so it's a three drop, but you get could get four mana out of it. That's nuts. Could just control get one zero until end of turn. Phoenix is my spirit animal. Oh yeah. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Uh provoke the trolls. <laughs> uh that's 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 me on the internet. <laughs> Provoke the Trolls deals 3 damage to any target. If creatures dealt damage this way, it gets 5-0 until end of turn. Okay, yep. <laughs> uh, Divine Gambit? Wait, have we seen this? Maybe? No? Uh, exile target artifact creature, enchantment opponent controls. The player puts a permanent from their hand onto the battlefield. Sick. Uh, Frostbire Arcanist? Fucking giant wizard? Damn. Look at thick. <laughs> you be provoking me, huh? Yeah. I mean, uh, maybe. <laughs> um, enter the battlefield, search your library for an instance of sorcery card with the same name as a card in your graveyard. Reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. Okay. Whoa! Ooh! Holy shit! Okay, hold up. Hold the fucking phone. Let's check this guy out. Who the hell? Toraf God of Fury. Okay, this is five bucks, but sure. <laughs> thick. Yeah, dude, fucking thick giant. <laughs> um, okay, so Toralf God of Fury, uh, four drop, five four trample. Um, whenever a creature planes walk an opponent controls, it deals excess combat, non-combat damage. Deals damage equal to the excess... To any target other than the permanent. Okay. Oh, we talking about Josh now? <laughs> uh, you know it. <laughs> Fucking thick. <laughs> okay, um, we got Toros Hammer. Uh, Josh definitely thick. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Um, Quid Creature gets one unattached Toros Hammer, deals three damage to any target, turn Toros Hammer to its owner's hand. Gets 3-0 as long as it's legendary. Okay. So is this like Thor's hammer? Probably. Okay. And then this guy's Thor? Okay, yeah, I could definitely see that. Dude, but hell yeah, dude, that's sick. <laughs> uh, and then we got a mountain, and then we got Elf Warrior. Okay. Nice. 
All right, it's three more packs, and then we're gonna get on to these set boosters. Ooh, holy shit! How long have I been doing this? I feel like I've been doing this for a while. <laughs> Whoo, golly! All right, let's fucking just blaze through this. Got wings of the cosmos. Oh, <laughs> gets one zero and gains flying. Look how! Look at this poor wolf. Who's just like, what's going on, guys? Help me! <laughs> uh, poor little wolf. Draugr thought thief. Okay. It's a scary time thing. Okay. R uh, village rights. Dude, that art looks crazy. Okay. Sorry, I keep getting distracted by pretty cards. Scorn effigy. Oh, they're bringing back scarecrows. Okay. Foretell zero. Damn. Okay. Mjolnir. Yeah, yeah. That looks like... That looks like uh, Mjolnir 100%. Yeah. Uh, Bind the Monster. Cool. Roots of Wisdom. Starheim Courser. Smashing Success. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> yeah, so this set is all Vikings and North, Norse mythology. It's really cool. <laughs> that wolf be like, oh god. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, save me. Save me, brothers. <laughs> Wait, where'd he go? Yeah, there he is. It's just, it's just like brothers, save me! <laughs> oh, oh, how cute. Um, okay, so Nico defies destiny. Gain two for each foretold card you own in exile. Uh, add two. Spend this mana only to foretell cards that have foretell. Turn target card with foretell from your graveyard to your hand. Okay. Neat. Okay. So, I think Nico, um, the new Planeswalker that they just came out with, is the first non-binary um, Planeswalker that they have, which I thought was really cool. And, ooh, Kolvori, God of Kinship. Okay. Sick. As long as you control... Three or more legendary creatures. Gets 4-2 and has Vigilance. Look at the top six cards of your library. You can reveal a legendary creature card from among them. Put them into your hand. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. Dude, that's sick! Hell yeah! Wait, is this a flip card? Oh, it is! Okay, nice! Uh, the Ringheart Crest. As it enters the battlefield, choose a creature type. Uh, add a forest... Spend this mana only to cast a creature spell of the chosen type or a legendary creature. That's cool. Okay, nice. I wonder who this is supposed to be. Um, my guess would be like... I don't know, maybe like... No, she doesn't have a bow, so it wouldn't be Artemis. Um... Used to have an Icelandic... Boyfriend, <laughs> head cream. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. See, that's the thing. So I, I play a lot of. Well, I haven't played it in a while, but I've played a lot of Smite, and so that's definitely taught me a lot of like the Norse mythology. Um, but obviously not enough for me to know who the hell that card was. <laughs> but yeah, okay. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Okay, let's see what we get in here. Undersea Invader. Fucking giant rogue? Does it, <laughs> is that like an oxymoron? Like, <laughs> I mean, I guess you can be a big dude and be sneaky. Uh, seize the spoils. Cool. Uh, Battlefield Raptor? Dude, look at this bird flying away from explosions. That's sick. <laughs> okay. Guardian Gladewalker. Elder Fang Disciple. Ooh. Pretty. Uh, raise the Draugr. Invoke the Divine. Uh, dwarven Reinforcements. Annul. Uh, counter Target Artifact or Enchantment Spell. Sick. Wait, for one drop? That's crazy. Okay. Uh, Gates of Istfel. Neat. Uh, weathered Runestone. Non-land permanent cards and graveyards. Can't enter the battlefield. Players can't cast spells from graveyards or libraries. Whoa! Okay, that's sick. Bloodline Pretender? Am I reading that right? Yeah, Bloodline Pretender. Okay. What is going on in that art? Okay. 
Changeling, as it enters the battlefield, choose a creature type. When another creature of the chosen type enters the battlefield under your control, put a 1 1 on it. Okay. And then In Search of Greatness. Oh, nice. Oh, dude, it's it's um, it's um uh, Ratatosker. Nice. At the beginning of your upkeep, you can attach, cast a permanent spell from your hand with converted mana cost equal to 1 plus the highest converted mana cost amongst permanents you control without paying its mana cost. If you don't scry one. Man, that is a mouthful. Okay. <laughs> and then Snowland. Neat. And Zombie Berserker. Cool. Nice. Okay. Man. Whew. Man, this is going to be a long episode. Because we aren't even fucking done yet. <laughs> um, but thank you guys for sticking around. It means a lot. I appreciate you a ton. Whew, okay. Uh, oh, Pilfering Hawk. Uh, dude, Stealing Bird. <laughs> uh, Qu Tormentor's Helm. Best Gear... Uh, something shield mate. Uh, we got the dread rider. Got ice high tool. Infernal pest. Imp. When you cast your second spell each turn, put a one one on infernal pest and it gains flying until end of turn. Thing looks like a fucking rat. Oh, I get it because he's eating a fucking butterfly or something. <laughs> Shimmer drift veil and his battlefield tapped. As end battlefield, choose a color. Oh, it's a oh, it's a land. Oh, wow, okay. Add one mana of the chosen color. Cool. That's cool. Okay. It's the Draugr. Okay, here we go. Uh, Glimpse the Cosmos. Dude, look at that fucking art. Damn. It's kind of spooky with, like, those those orb eye-looking things behind her. Um, Look at the top three cards of your library. Put them onto your hand and the rest of the bottom of your library in any order. So I'm going to control a giant. Cast Glimpse of the Cosmos from your graveyard by paying one rather than paying its mana cost. Whoa! If you pay, if you cast it this way, and it would be punching his graveyard, exile it instead. Oh, okay, sure. So you just can't keep doing it. Uh, Carter, Doom Scourge, seen him? Uh, Doom Scar Titan. Have Have we seen this guy? I don't think so. Okay. When he enters the battlefield, create creature control, get one zero and gain haste. Sick. And then Arnie Broken Bow. Oh, okay, yeah. This is the other dude. Yeah, we already seen him. And then planes and spirit token. Look at the spirit token. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Okay. All right. Whew. All right. Now, before we get into these, I'm going to take a second to get a drink of water. <coughs> Whew. Ooh, golly. All right. Man, you know... <laughs> Part of me thinks I should have split these up between different episodes, but you know what? Fuck it. Because, ooh, ooh, look at that. See, this is the whole reason why I wanted to get set boosters of this set, because they come with full art cards like this. Look at this. I think this was the, um, the giant wizard, right? Um, Agar the Freezing Flame. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what kind of water are you drinking? Uh, sparkling water. Uh, Trader Joe's sparkling water. <laughs> uh, thank you for asking, Arturo. <laughs> uh, because I've become one of those people <laughs> who drink sparkling water. Because I'm... Uh, <laughs> it's, it's, it's what you do when you're old, right? <laughs> uh, fearless pup. Sweet little pup pup. Uh, mammoth growth. Got Southful Pack Mage, got Struggle for Stremcar, Giant something, King Harold's Revenge. Okay, I don't think we've seen this. Toy Creature one, gets 1-1 one, one for each. Creature you control against Trample. Must be blocked this turn, if able. Oh, okay. Forcing people to block. Crush the Weak. Deals 2 damage to each creature. If, de if a creature dealt damage this way, would die this turn, exile it. Okay. Um, ooh, okay. So we got Snowland. Wait, rare snowland? Okay. Um, wait, faceless haven. Oh, dude, look at that. That's pretty. Okay. Uh, add a colorless, and then three snowlands becomes a four-three creature with vigilance and all creature types until end of turn. It's still a land. 
Dude, that's nuts. Okay. Ooh. Got Jorn. God of Winter. Hell yeah. Look at that. Um, when Jorn attacks, untap each snow permanent you control. Oh, and it's also an artifact. Hold up. Uh, called Ring, the Rhyme Staff. Oh, okay. Legendary Snow Artifact. You can play target snow permanent from your graveyard this turn. If you do, it enters the battlefield tapped. What the fuck? That's an amazing card. Like, both sides are pretty fucking amazing. Hot damn. And I wonder who that is. Um, oh god, who's the, the wolf? Who's, who's wolf companion? Oh, I don't remember. But still, like, damn, look at that. That's beautiful. Okay. Got Ice Spine Pillar. And then a Foil Yeti. Shiny Yeti. Fucking Disco Yeti. Alright. Um, <laughs> Alright, let's see what other full art cards we can get out of this. Like, oh man. This is one reason why I was so excited for this goddamn set. Because, like, oh, hell yeah, look at that. Fuck yeah, man. See, Magic needs to do more of these. Like, just show off the fucking art. Like, look at that. Glittering Frost. Nice. I think we pulled one of these. I might be wrong, but look at that full art card. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, we got Highland Forest. We got the Berserker. We got fucking Elf. Uh, Feed the Serpent. Exile Target Creature or Planeswalker. Okay, nice. Y'all, the Forsaken, way down. Okay. As an additional cost to cast a spell, Exile Creature card from your graveyard. Gets 3-3 three, three until end of turn. Okay, sure. Did pull one of those? Yeah, yeah, I thought we did. Uh, with the Crown, Chant Creature gets has base power 0 and has at the beginning of your upkeep, you lose a life until you sacrifice this creature. Weird. Bruh, I'd be more active, but... My bad, I was washing my hair. <laughs> oh no, you good girl. You fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Return upon the tide. Put in your graveyard to the battlefield. If it's an elf, create two elf warrior creature tokens. Yeah, you fine, girl. You don't. You 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 don't. You don't have to comment. But I do appreciate your company. Each player sacrifices two permanents. Oh yeah, we've seen that one. Uh, ooh, what is this? Furges. Retribution? Okay, so that's gotta be, uh, that's gotta be Freya, right? Create a 4-4 angel token with flying and vigilance until end turn angels control get short target creature with power less than this creature. Angels in control gain double strike until end turn. Yeah, cause, uh, Freya was the Valkyrie, right? Yeah, so, in this one, all angels are Valkyries. Oh, is that not a flip? Okay, yeah. And then we get Harald King Skemfar. Seen that dude? And we got Shiny Divine Gambit. Okay. Neat. And careful study. Oh, little mini games? Oh, okay. Sure. I'll have to read that later. See what that's about. Yeah, like I said, you don't you don't have to comment. I just appreciate you guys being here. Oh, my fucking god, look at that! Look at this motherfucking art! I love this! <laughs> Who are you? Who are you? Funeral Longboat? Okay, I don't think we pulled one of these, but still! Like, look at that beautiful fucking art! Hell yeah, man! Okay, let's see what we get in here. We got Ice Tunnel. Got Cold Spell Cleric. <clears throat> God's Hall Guardian. Pretty Kitty. Uh, Wings of the Cosmos. Uh, <laughs> oh God, help me! <laughs> oh man, just just the look on that wolf's face. <laughs> Who are you, whore? Excuse me. <laughs> Wait, who who are you talking about here? <laughs> Josh talking to the cards. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, you're right. There's sometimes I'm just like, who the fuck are you? 
Um, put a 1-1 one, one on target creature you control. Gets hexproof until end of turn. Uh, poison the cup. Cool. Destroy target creature. Spell is foretold. Scry 2. Okay. Zerker. Vengeful Reaper. Yeah. Fucking Dark Angels. Sick. Uh, Hailstorm Valkyrie. Nice. Oh, dude. Yeah, nice. It's Nico. Yeah. It's Nico Eris. Um, is this worth anything? Hold up. Let me see. Where are you at, Nico? So, yeah, like I said earlier, this is um, Magic the Gathering's first non binary planeswalker. Um, I forget when exactly they came out. Um, but yeah. Um, okay, so Nico Aris, uh, X and 3. Okay, and it's Battlefield create X shard tokens. The hell's a shard token? Uh, up to one target creature control can't be blocked this turn. Whenever that creature deals damage this turn, return it to its owner's hand. Deals 2 damage to target tapped creature for each card you've drawn this turn. And create a shard token. Weird, so there's no, like... Like, big ultimate for this one. Huh. Weird. I'm gonna have to look up what the hell the shard tokens are. Um, Ice Bind Pillar. Hold on, let me fix that again. Okay, yeah. Ice Bind Pillar. Um, Shiny Horizon Seeker. Cool. And on the end, totally lost. Okay. <laughs> Whew. Oh, hell yeah, dude. What is what is that even? Ultimate by Denzel Curry. <laughs> oh, man. What what the hell am I looking at? Is that just like a tornado of, like, weapons and shit? Thought a shard is when you... <laughs> Arturo. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Uh, Y'all are funny. Y'all are too much. <laughs> uh, strategic planning, Mist of Lethargia, um, Brian Bauer or something, uh, Anal, uh, we got Bind the Monster, we got Disdain Disdainful Stroke, okay. Uh, Kaya's Onslaught? Whoa! Looks like she's stabbing the shit out of the fucking uh, Vorinclex. It's 1 1 against Double Strike until end of turn. Okay. Cosmos Charger. Oh, dude, it's a fucking... It's a horse spirit. Look at that art. Hell yeah. Beautiful. Um, Four drop, flash flying. Uh, foretelling cards from your hand cost one less and can be done on any player's turn. Damn. Okay. That's sick. And then we got Realm Walker. Ooh. Okay. Uh, two one changeling, three drop, and just battlefield. Choose a creature type. You can look at the top card of your library anytime. You may cast creature spells from the chosen chosen type from the top of your library. Fucking sick. Okay. Um, we got Inga Rune Eyes. Okay. Legendary creature, human wizard. When just battlefield, scry three. When it dies, draw three cards. If three or more creatures died this turn. Okay, cool. And we got Jaspera Sentinel. Cool. And, wait a, wait a minute, this isn't from this set, what the hell? Mem Knight? Isn't that fucking Mirrodin? Yeah, wait, Mondra's Memnarch brain still cost Mirrodin reminiscent of his form, if not his power. Wait a minute, that's fucking, so wait, is this card on the list? And then you can get list cards from this set? That's weird. Huh. Okay. Nice. <laughs> A nice little surprise. Oh, is that Zach? Oh, what's up, baby? Oh, how you doing, baby? I miss you. <laughs> Hold up. Before before we continue, I want to show Zach what we got. Um, so first and foremost, we've been... Oh, is that Geo 2? Oh, hell yeah. How you guys doing? So yeah, we got some full art cards. Uh, we got Nico... Um, somewhere down here, we got fucking, uh, Thor's hammer, and Thor, yeah, Thor Elf, God of Fury, and on the back we got that fucking Thor's hammer, and then, hold up, you wanna see the goods, wait for it, wait for it, we got 
Goldspan Dragon, more fucking twenty five bucks. And then on like one of the first packs that we opened, we got more fucking Vorinclex, Monster Schrader. Yeah, I don't know what the hell he's doing in this set, but he's here. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> Uh, I'm so happy you guys are here. Hell yeah. So yeah, we opened so many goddamn packs. <laughs> Yorn is dank. Yeah, man. <laughs> Shit rules. But yeah, we opened up like nine draft boosters. I opened up like two or three fucking uh, of the little theme boosters. And that's where we got boring clacks from. <laughs> there we go. Oh, look how nice everybody is saying hi to each other. Oh, I love this. Oh, backwards card. Ooh, pretty. Hell yeah. Oh, look. What the hell is that? <laughs> Cute little, like, squirrel or something. Uh, who are you? We got Yorn God of Winter. Okay. Hell yeah. Mo fucking Yorn. <laughs> Alright, here we go. We got Snowfield Sinkhole. We got Haggy Mob. It's it's Kelsey. <laughs> um we got Breakneck Berserker. We got Run Amuck. Um hold on. I think the rare's next? No. Uh Binding the Old Gods. Ooh, okay. I haven't seen this. Short Target on Pep. Monland permanent opponent control, search your library for forced, put it on the battlefield tap and shuffle your library. Creatures control gain death touch till end of turn. Sick. Okay. Uh we got Finn, Fangbear, seen him. Whoa! Old growth troll. Okay. Three drop four four trample. When he dies if it was wait. When he dies if it was a creature. Return it to the battlefield if it's it's an ore enchantment with the enchant forest you control, and enchant forest has add ta add two and one sacrifice this land creature. Create a tapped four four green troll token creature with trample. Jesus, how Vorinclex got to Kaldheim is still a mystery, but Kaya was there to hurt him. Got away poison. Tybalt stole some sk some sap from the world tree, then used it to return to New Phyrexia. So maybe Phyrexian Tybalt in the future. Ooh, okay. That's interesting, yeah. Yeah, because I was wondering how how a fucking Phyrexian got off of fucking Phyrexia. Who knows? Okay, um, so Old Girls Troll. That's fucking sick. Yeah, thank you for the lore, friend. I appreciate that. Uh, Priest of the Haunted Edge. And Foil, Jarl of the Forsaken. Sick. Okay. And what is this? Magic minigame strictly better? <laughs> Zach, it's you. <laughs> Strictly better. <laughs> oh man, this is nice. Eh. I'm glad you guys could show up. Um. Oh man. Eh. It's getting to that point in the episode where I can't open these goddamn packs. <laughs> um. Ooh. Pretty card. More fucking beautiful, man. <laughs> Remember the time you bought me cookies when I was sick? Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> yeah, Zach's a good boy. Uh, smashing success. Mm, smashing. <laughs> uh, Craven Hulk, giant coward. Weird. Can't block alone. Um, uh, okay. Yeah. Whoa, demon bolt. Dude, look at that fucking art. Fuck yeah, man. Uh, we got Undersea Invader, fucking giant rogue. Uh, we got Squash. <laughs> Hell yeah. We got Rune Immortality. Oh, it's the black one. Okay, nice. It's a battlefield draw card. Enchanted permanent is a creature gets death touch. If it's a equipment, equip, equipped creature has death touch. Yeah. Okay. Koi the Forge Master. Seen him. Oh, Bergy. God of Storytelling? Okay. Um, three drop, three, three. When you cast a spell, add a mountain. Till end of turn, you don't lose this mana as steps and phrases end. Creatures in control can boast twice during each of your turns rather than once. Oh, okay. And then flip. 
We got Harnfell Horn of Bounty. Okay. Uh, five drop, discard a card, exile the top two cards of your library. You can play those cards this turn. Damn! Dude, that's fucking sick. Okay. Hell yeah. It's motherfucking Bergy. <laughs> and then, ooh! Okay. Cold the Forge Master. Oh, nice! It's the alt art of the other dude. Okay. Yeah, when a controller dies of a chanted equip, return to its owner's hand. Yeah, but look at that art. Fuck yeah. I love the, like, the border that they do on the side. Like, look at that. More fucking beautiful. And... Ooh, yes, yeah, Storm. Okay. Blood on the Snow. Ooh, Foil Blood on the storm. Snow. Okay. Choose one. Destroy all creatures. Destroy all Planeswalkers. Then return a creature or Planeswalker card with converted man cost X or less from a graveyard to the battlefield where X is... The amount of snow plane or snow land spent to cast a spell. Damn. Burgalicious diff. Burgalicious diff. <laughs> diff, 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 diff. <laughs> and then bird. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, Zach, I'm so glad you're here. I miss you, friend. <laughs> uh, treasure token. And oh, what the fuck is even going on in this card? Yo, oh, it's upside down. That's why. But dude, look at that. That shit's sick. What is this? Uh, Starnheim Unleashed. Okay, sick. But dude, that's fucking beautiful. Look at that. Dude, I'm sleeving all of those fucking full art cards. Oh, my man, I miss you too. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to have to come by the coffee shop and we go get coffee. It'll be nice. Uh, we got Frost Augur. Um, one drop. Uh, Snowland tap. Look at the top card of your library. If it's a snow card, you can reveal it, put it into your hand. Sick. Cyclone Summoner. Ooh, Okay. Uh, seven drop, seven seven, giant wizard. <laughs> when he enters the battlefield, if you cast it from your hand, return all permanents to their owner's hands, except for giants, wizards, and lands. Ooh, damn, that's some shit though. <laughs> uh, sculptor of winter, neat. And foil, iron verdict. Okay, pretty nice. Okay. Uh, ba ba ba. Man, I feel like I've been at this for, like, shit, it's almost ten, my lord. <laughs> um, damn, look at that. Big ol' serpent. Is he eating a boat? No, he's not eating anything. Um, we got Coma Cosmo Serpent. Okay, hell yeah. Whew. Okay, got Highland Forest, Mist of Lajara. Branch uh, we got Anal, we got Find the Monster, we got Disdainful Stroke, uh, Scorn Effigy, Glimpse of the Cosmos, we got Agar, again, fucking Giant Wizard. So yeah, I'd imagine fucking Storm being crazy with all these fucking Giant Wizard cards. Um, and we got, ooh, Aegon, God of Death. Yo, okay. Um, 3-drop, 6-6 six, six Death Touch. Uh, at the beginning of your upkeep, exile 2 cards from your graveyard. If you can't, sacrifice it and draw a card. Okay. And then flip. Uh, Throne of Death. 1-drop, at the beginning of your upkeep, mill a card. Uh, pay 3 and tap it. Return a creature card from your graveyard. Draw a card. Okay. That's fucking sick. Nice. And then here we got Inga Runeyes. Seen them. And we got, ooh, Maja, Bredegard Protector. Have we seen this one? I don't think so. Other creatures control get 1 1. Land and spout field into control, get, create a 1 1 white human warrior creature token. Sick. Okay. <laughs> Whew. Man. Man, I'm. We're gonna have so many cards to go through once this is all over. Sheesh. Uh, Booster Sleuth? Okay, here. Keep that to the side. I want to check those out later. 
Um, and who we got here? Oh, my lord. We got Tegrid, God of Fright. Um, who sh who is she? Um, marry me. Uh, marry me. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I'm loving these fucking full art cards. Shit rules. Rachniform, Ice Hide, Broken Wings. We got fucking Recluse. <laughs> uh, we got the Fearless Puppy. <laughs> we still got packs to go. Yeah, this is um I think last three. <laughs> I love it. Thank you. Hell yeah. Virgia. Tegrid a baddie? Oh yeah, Tegrid a baddie. <laughs> He's neat. He's about as old as Elrune. But he ages in reverse, so he looks like a teenager now, so none of the other gods take him seriously. Even though he's the literal god of death. Yeah, that's what I thought, because I saw, I saw him, and I was just like, man, he looks little. Like, he looks hella tiny. <laughs> so, he's, so he's fucking Benjamin buttoning it, fucking aging in reverse. <laughs> um, okay, so yeah, here we got Frisia. Judge of Valor. Flying Life Link. When you cast a second spell each turn, look at the top three cards of your library. One of them into your hand and the rest into your graveyard. Hell yeah. Dream Devourer. Ooh. Demon Cleric. Two drop, zero three. Fucking each non land card in your hand without foretell has foretell. Its foretell cost is equal to its mana cost reduced by two. Okay. When you foretell a card, Dream Devourer gets two zero until end of turn. Damn! That's fucking sick! And then we got Ice High Troll. And. Ooh! Foil Revitalize. Okay. Pretty. Hell yeah! <laughs> That's me. Dream Devourer? <laughs> or Revitalize? <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I'm a demon cleric. <laughs> Oh man, but I'm so glad you guys stuck around and and, and and are enjoying this so far. It means a lot. I appreciate you guys. Um, who the hell is this? Um, Halvar, God of Battle? Okay. Hell yeah. Yeah, dude, honestly, I want to get more of these fucking set boosters just for these full art cards. Shit's beautiful. Uh, Draugr Recruiter, Dog Pursuit. Okay, hold on. Uh, uh. Spirit of Aldegard, fucking bear spirit. Uh, it's Zack. <laughs> um, Blizzard Brawl, thank you for providing content. No, thank you for being here, friend. I appreciate you. <laughs> and ooh, Cosmos Elixir. The fuck? Okay. Four drop at the beginning of your end step, draw a card if your life total is greater than your starting life total. Otherwise, you gain two life. That's fucking sick. <laughs> okay. And we got Alt Art Finn, Fang Bear. Look at that. Hell yeah. Good shit. And then, whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, okay. Okay, hold up. Whoo! Burning Rune Demon. Okay, that's like three bucks. But still, look at that. Demon Berserker, fucking 6 drop 6-6 six, six with flying when it's battlefield. You can search your library for exactly two cards, not named Burning Root, Rune Demon, that have different names. If you do, reveal those cards, an opponent chooses one of them. Put the chosen card into your hand and the other into your library, or into your graveyard, then shuffle your library. Okay. Dude, but that's sick though. Look at that art. Hell yeah, man. Beautiful. That's what's up. Okay. Nice. Whew. And we are down to our last pack. Man. <laughs> this has been a fucking journey, man. Sheesh. <laughs> Thank you guys for being here for it. Um, ooh. Wait, is that like a Cyclops? No, no, it's that's just his mouth. Okay. But some fucking giant. Um, Quakebringer. Neat. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Dwarven Reinforcements. Gold Maw Champion. Gilded Assault Cart. Okay, ooh, Forging the Tyrite Sword. 
Haven't seen this. Uh, one and two, create a treasure token, search a library for a card named Holvar, got a battle, or an equipment card, reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your library. Okay. Nice. Dwarven Hammer, nice. Fearless Liberator. Uh, Warhammer Scald, okay. Comes tapped, if it's enchanted or equipped, create a 2-1 Red Dwarf. Nice. Ooh, nice, we got another Realm Walker. Hell yeah. Considering putting that in the fucking Sliver deck. Um, ooh, Pyre of Heroes. Two drop, two and tap, sack a creature, search your library for a creature card that shares a creature type with the sacrifice creature. It has converted mana cost one to one plus the creature's converted mana cost. Oh, put that card into the battlefield, then shuffle your library. Activate this only any time you could cast a sorcery. I might put that in the sliver deck. Holy shit. Okay. That's fucking nuts. And, yeah, tribal birthing pod. Yeah, who'd have thunk? <laughs> Uh, Sertland Flinger. Okay, Giant Berserker. Oh wait, was this one with the fling, like, it, like, built into it? Yeah. When you attack, you can sacrifice a creature. When you do, it deals damage equal to the sacrifice creature power to any target. Yeah! Sacrifice creature was a giant, it deals twice that much damage. So you could just fucking fling giants at people, man. Hell yeah. Feels good. <laughs> and then we got Foil Iron Verdict. And Booster Blitz? Do we have this one? Sleuth, Strictly Better, Careful Study? No, okay, yeah, I'm gonna check those out later, because I want to see what those are about. Because they seem like nice little fun ways to play Magic without having to fucking buy a fucking, uh, whatchamacallit, like, a starter deck, you know? Okay, so let's go through what we got here. Because, <laughs> boy howdy, do we have a lot. Okay, so we got Foil, Iron Verdict... Got Surfling Flinger, got Pyre Heroes, got Realm Walker, Full Art Card, gonna go up there. Uh, Burning Rune Demon, hell yeah. Cosmos Elixir, got Full Art, um, who are you again? Halvar, yeah. Nice, okay. Uh, we got Dream Devourer, we got another Full Art, um, Tegrid, uh, Marry Me. <laughs> Josh be like, ooh, shoddy, okay. <laughs> like, hell yeah. Uh, put that over there. We got Egon, got a death. We got Foil uh, Worm. <laughs> got another Iron Verdict. Got Cyclone Summoner. We got fucking Angel Dudes. <laughs> we got Blood in the Snow. Fuck yeah. We got Bergy, uh, Burgalicious, with her horn. Got full art. Uh, I think this was like a troll or something. Giant troll. Not word slumber bound. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we got foil yarl of the forsaken. Got old growth troll. Got this dude. <laughs> um. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay. Got foil sentinel. Got realm walker. Got cosmos charger. Got that. Got foil that. We got Nico. Um, we got Boat. <laughs> uh, we got Divine Gambit. We got the King of uh, Skemfar, right? Uh, Furja's Retribution. We got another Full Art card. Which, again, I gotta say, like, I fucking love these. Look at that. Beautiful, man. Uh, we got fucking Yeti. <laughs> fucking uh, Party Yeti. We got Yorn. We got Faceless Haven. We got fucking uh, Giant Wizard. <laughs> uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. We got Arnie. Uh, we got In Search of Greatness with fucking uh, Ratatosker. We got Kolvori, got a kinship. We got fucking Thor and his hammer. Hell yeah. We got Ratatosker. Fucking Squirrel. Got Skemfar Shadow Mage. Okay, we got, we got Alt Art. Arnie, which I fucking love that art, man. It's fucking beautiful. Um, got Foil Land. Put that over there. Okay. Uh, Draugr Necromancer. Whew. Got Elder, Mer uh, Elder Mentor. Elder Leaf Mentor. Why can't I words anymore? <laughs> uh, we got Tyrite Sanctum. Yeah. We got Skemfar Avenger. Uh, we got Surfland Flinger. Oh, yeah, yeah. We already pulled him earlier. Yeah. And then on the end here, 
got Big Boy Goldspan Dragon, and we also got the motherfucking Vorinclex, <laughs> which I was so excited that we got because we got him out of a uh, we got him out of a fucking green themed booster, <laughs> which was phenomenal. Uh, much like this episode. So yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, thank you guys for being here. I appreciate each and every single one of you. Uh, I love you a ton. And, yeah, I, I hope you liked the video. Um, leave a like if you did. Uh, subscribe for more. And, again, thank you guys so much for being here. Uh, this episode was pretty fun. And almost two hours, I think? Jesus Christ, I've been doing this for a while. So, um, yeah, like I said, thank you guys so much for being here. Um, I love you guys. Stay safe. And, yeah, I'll see you guys next week. Uh, bye. <laughs>